Well, good evening to you and uh, welcome on this most perfect evening for a game of football. Conditions are absolutely splendid and the folk of this town have come out in their droves for this match. Why would they? It is an ideal circumstance for what could be an ideal game. Everybody has been attracted to it. It has been the talk of the town and uh, the buses have been packed. Double-decker buses lining up outside. Coaches have carried thousands of away supporters here too and uh, all of it adds up to make a terrific, a crackling atmosphere. The match, I think, will be quite a spectacle. And this must be amongst the favoured arenas of supporters all over the world. It really does have a very special feel to it. So, Jim, tell me this, who are you looking for in particular? Yeah, Keylor Navas, he could make all the difference because he's such an excellent shot stopper. It's not just a matter of reflexes, though. It's the way he spreads his body in front of the ball, preventing strikers from getting a sight at goal. He also hardly ever makes an error, and that's precious for a goalkeeper. Well, quite no argument for me on that one. got things on the way well that's where he wants it long ball but not especially accurate tries to locate someone up front well he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there yeah the idea was right the delivery wasn't they can revisit that further on oh well defended that had to be done hoists it forward well read, he sorted that out. Made towards the front men. That's just very well played. He can't hurt you with his back to goal, and he didn't go for the back heel. Plays it out to the wing. Chance to play it in. That's sprayed out wide. Knocks it away. And that's been one straight back. Tries to get it forward quickly. Being played forward. I think that's offside. Yes, it is. Gets it back. Chance to break, it's got through to him, it's got through, gets away from his opponent. Peter, we can only applaud that quality of tackle in the circumstances, it was probably goal-saving. Quick ball forward. Campbell. Trout calling for him to shoot. Neither team has yet managed to impose any authority, and uh, as a consequence, this game's just drifted. Torres. Forward it goes. Cleared away. More than happy to take the muscular approach. It's a very good battle there, terrific to watch. 
and it's played forward. A forward pass. And that's surely a foul free kick. That's a fine challenge. Hoists it forward. Has he found his man? Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. And it's played forward. Torres gets it away. Good work on the right flank. Now, what's next? Driving on, he's had a shot! for half time. So both sides have drawn blanks and have toiled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. How would you review the first half? Well, they look lost for ideas and, and lacking in talent, which all contributes to a, a chronic case of impotence. Costa Rica head to the dressing room, not yet having broken through. Tight, cagey game. Not the team any further forward than they were when they started out. Already up and running for the second half. At least there's always a plus side to a scoreless half. Defences are doing what they should, and it's going to take good imagination to break the deadlock here. Drives it towards the front. And that'll go straight through to the keeper. Forward it goes. Knocks it away. Ball's loose. Who's getting there? Oh, he's found it. Has a hit! Oh, that's a terrific save from the keeper. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. So now we're going to get those changes we have been expecting. And that has been cleared. Panama are keeping their men at arm's length here. Yeah, I just think it's a, a conservative move to deny runners the opportunity of, of going beyond that rear guard. And that has been clubbed away. Panama making another change here. Campbell. Tries to get it forward quickly. Steered forward. No breakthrough and well into the second period. It is still anyone's get Shoots! Looks to bypass the midfield. Hoists it forward. And that's been levered clear. It's a loose ball.
Panama really are enduring a, a frustrating spell when it comes to trying to move the ball around the midfield. They, they lack the sharpness and urgency. And it's played forward. Torres does well there, alert. Up towards the front line. Forward it goes. Concentration levels are very good, and so is the commitment. This game could yet yield a winner. A really good feat. Goes for goal! Oh, that is rather wayward. <laughs> Panama are able now to make their substitution. It's been on the cards for uh, a few moments now. Yeah, he's run himself into the ground, hasn't he? And it's it's good to see that the crowd appreciate his efforts because he has put in a real honest shift. You wonder if that's it now, but there may be one more opportunity, Peter, for a late, late steal here. Plays a clever pass. Well, both sides might have to settle for a draw here, although there's still a chance for one last fling. He's played him through. And that will be the final act. A frustrating game for attackers on either side. They hardly had a sniff. Defence is broadly in charge, and it has finished goalless. Thank you.